today it's going to be Daddy and Sunday. Um, I'm giving Linda, Linda the day off. Um, she's been working hard this week. Um, I had to go do a few things for work, and it, I got to make it up to her. So, on top of that, it's going to be a little bit of bonding time for me and Mateo. So, I'm going to take him to the park for a little bit. We might go out to the mall. Might we're just going to be out. That's that's what we're going to do. Um, it started off a little rocky this morning. Uh, we got him down to waking up around eight, nine o'clock. We put him to bed a little bit later, but um, yeah, we we did that, and he had a little bit of a rough night, and then he ended up waking up at six. Partly my fault, instead of instead of uh, rocking him back to sleep, I did my typical thing of waking him up. That was cop car. So uh, yeah, instead of the typical. Um, I lost my train of thought. Instead of the typical waking him up whenever he starts starts squirming, uh, I should have rocked him back to sleep. But he's fine. He took his nap and he's all good. He's just chilling in the back. Yeah, just looking out the window. But yeah, um, I'm gonna take him to post for a little bit, and then I'll take him to the park and all that good stuff. Catch you guys there. All right. So uh, that took a lot longer than I expected. I haven't gotten him to the park yet. I had to take care of some things at work. For the record, if your employer has something that you need to get done, don't, don't not say, or don't say, don't not tell the person that needs to get the things done the day of the day it needs to be done. I know I, that sounded like a whole jumble right there, but point is, if something needs to be done, let it be known as soon as possible, not the last second. Because that's what happened, and poor little guy, I had him here longer than he should have been. So I'm going to make it up to him, taking him to the park right now, and we're going to have a good time. Little man back there sleeping. He's all tuckered out. See, he does what I wish I could do when I got to do this stuff. Poor little boy, I'm so gonna make it up to him. Maybe some ice cream? Yeah, maybe some ice cream. Oh, little boy. You and daddy are gonna have some fun. Don't worry, take your nap, we'll be there soon. Yeah, I just wanna say that I am very thankful for the fact that we're gonna be going to Hawaii for the next six years. I've never been uh, Linda has been with family and her family loves it. It is It is expensive, but you know, it's There's always adjustments that you can make um, I'm mostly appreciative of the fact that we started here and then now we're gonna be moving into the beautiful island of Hawaii it's, it's something that a lot of people dream of, of just even vacationing there, and I get, you know, my family gets to be there for the next few years. Mateo gets to walk on sand for his first few years of even walking. He's gonna go to a lot of luau's as a little, as a toddler, and I can't wait to see him in those little hula skirts because I'm gonna put one on him. You know, you, you gotta appreciate the little things in life, and that's. Granted, it is a major one, moving to Hawaii or just moving in general. But the fact that these little things that we're going to be able to do there are going to make such an impact on his life at such a young age. And I'm so thankful for that. I'm so thankful that I can give him that opportunity. Yeah, just wanted to make a little quick tidbit about that.
having that much fun. Um, it is a hot day. Um, I did get them in, into the little water, water fountain area. And he got his feet wet and I soaked his hair a little bit. He touched the, the water spouts. Got him on the swing a little bit. I had him practice some walking. So, what do you think, Bubba? Yeah, did we have a good day? He's like, I'm not gonna forget where you, where you took me. <laughs> oh, this has been a good day so far. He's gonna get some ice cream later. Mama doesn't have to know about it. But, uh, but I, I can sneak in just a little bit of ice cream. She doesn't have to know. She'll end up finding out though. That's just, that's just her. All right, but we're on our way home now. So, we're home. And we've been here for a little bit. Tell me, the boy was facing my direction just a couple minutes ago. Now he's, yep, doing that, trying to watch TV. How do you do this to yourself? I don't even know how it happens. It happens in like a swift motion, and we always miss it. You're crazy. All right, so this is the end of our Daddy and Sunday. We had a lot of fun. I did end up giving him ice cream. I forgot to film it. He loves ice cream, and I hope he doesn't get an acquired taste to it just yet. We already have enough enough trouble keeping ice cream just between me and Linda. <laughs> but yeah, I think we had a good time today, and Linda got some time to herself. So, all around, great day. Hope you guys liked the video. Comment what you'd like to see next. You sound like a robot. And <laughs> subscribe if you want to hear my robot voice a little bit more. <laughs> Alright guys, we'll catch you in the next video. Say goodbye, Mateo. Bye.